What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Now this video is going to be likely for a small group of home theater enthusiasts. But before we get into it, if you love watching movies and love the home theater experience, consider subscribing for videos on media content and home theater tech reviews. All right, I just wanted to do a quick video for all the folks out there that want to use an Apple TV for streaming media content into an Oppo 203 or 205 player and still have Dolby Atmos. Why would you want to do this? Well, if you're using a projector with a fixed anamorphic lens like the setup that I use, you can watch all the movies that have black bars, better known as letterbox, on a scope screen. What's a scope screen? Well, TVs are a 16 by 9 aspect ratio and a scope screen is a 21 by 9 aspect ratio. So when people complain about black bars on their TVs because the movie is wider than their display, using a projector with lens will let you take that image and stretch it to fill a 21 by 9 wide screen, eliminating those horrible black bars. You can of course just zoom in on the screen, but then you're losing resolution by not using all the available pixels. But that's another topic for discussion. So one of the big features that Oppo included in their players is a 21 by 9 zoom option for use when using a lens and projector combo. Problem is, when you run the Apple TV into the Oppo, you can use the zoom feature, but you no longer get Dolby Atmos surround. Why doesn't it work? Well, Apple TV uses the Dolby Matte 2.0 container, which the Oppo doesn't support, so it'll pass through the player as 5.1 and not Atmos. Well, that's not good. Normally, you'd have the Apple TV plugged into the Oppo, then from the Oppo to the receiver or processor, then to the projector. You know, the normal way. But this way equals no Atmos. Well, the workaround is to plug the Apple TV into the processor or receiver so the audio gets decoded first to the speakers. Then the HDMI output to the processor or receiver goes into the Oppo. So now you can just hit the zoom button and have it fit the screen. Then the Oppo output out to the projector. Now we have proper Atmos sound and you can use the scaling option on the Oppo for the letterbox content on the Apple TV. Obviously, if you have a dedicated video scaler like a Lumigen, then you wouldn't have to do this but they cost a ridiculous amount of money. Now, one drawback is that you always have to turn on the Oppo anytime you wanna watch something, which is a bit of a nuisance. Now, if you found this video useful, give it a like. Let us know if you're a projector user and do you use a lens or do you just zoom in? Check us out on social media, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or if you want faster responses from us, check out our Patreon page. And if you're new here, hit that subscribe button for more videos like this.